Hi everyone. Today we are making coconut yogurt. This is a dairy free and a vegan way to make yogurt in your Thermomix. It uses a can of coconut milk and a can of coconut cream. Then we're going to add some arrowroot starch or tapioca flour. Now we're going to add some agar agar. This is also from the health food store. Um, this is a animal product free gelatin substitute. Adding maple syrup gives it a little bit of sweetness. Feel free to skip this step. Now we're going to place the lid on and we are going to blend and heat the mixture up to 80 degrees. Then once that has completed, we do need to let it cool down to 45 degrees. So this takes about an hour and a half. So just leave the bowl on your bench. Um, you can check the temperature by putting the bowl back into position and on the temperature dial, it will say how hot the bowl is. Now grab a little bowl and pour out some of the cooled yogurt mixture. Then take two probiotic capsules, um, preferably dairy free, and add them into the cooled yogurt mixture and give them a good stir. Now we want to add back the yogurt mixture with the probiotics back into the bowl, placing the lid on and blending just to combine. Now we're gonna place the yogurt mixture into some yogurt pots, or if you have a white thermo server, you can pour the entire yogurt mixture into that and place it into the Vroma. Today for this example, I am using the yogurt pots. I find the yogurt pots are the perfect size for the kids to enjoy. You can get these from the mix shop. Once you have poured all the yogurt mixture into your jars or your thermo server, place into the Varoma and then we're going to ferment for over 10 hours. Now you can adjust this to finish at an appropriate time. So if it's going to beep at you at five o'clock in the morning, just extend the fermentation time by two hours. It's not going to affect the end results. Now it's the morning time. It's been 10 hours. So now we need to pop the yogurt into the fridge for eight hours just to set and then you are ready to enjoy. Now the yogurt's fermented, it's sat in the fridge for its eight hours and look how thick and creamy this yogurt is. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video.